Hey there! I watched the video by uh, Gary V, and I love, I really like his per perspective and point of views on a lot of things, right? And I love how sometimes he's a little like, I don't know if harsh is the right word, but he goes like right to the point, right where it hurts. And I know a lot of people might not be ready for that because it might trigger things in you, right? If you might not be ready to accept the truth. and But I feel like he has so many points that it's like, oh shit, like he might be right on that one. And so I like that, I really appreciate that. And he was talking about millennials, right? And that's a topic that I love. Millennials and, and career and, and future and dreams and goals and all that stuff, right? Because we're in a whole different time right now. Way different than what the past generations have been through. So. He made some good points, and one was that after college, right, you're basically starting at zero. So no one cares what happened before, you're starting at zero. And a lot of people, I can definitely relate to that myself. A lot of millennials, we, we talk a lot about what we're going to do, right? And no one gives a shit about what you're going to do. I think I'd rather you show me than tell me, right? I used to, believe me, up to today, I just, I always talk about what I'm going to do, right? <laughs> I have so many ideas of what I'm going to do, right? And in some ways, I haven't done shit. And in some ways, I don't, I haven't been able to accept that reality. Uh, fears have held me back and insecurities and all internal things that I've worked through and I'm still working through and I'll, I'll continue to work through. But he was sharing the idea of executing for 18 months and then you'll be able to show your work, right? Show what you've done. And I think sometimes we get caught up in the idea that we need to prepare so much for what we want to do, right? My career, my life purpose my whatever you we think that we need to prepare so much but maybe maybe it's a balance of as i'm going through it i'm learning i'm growing i'm expanding and and you're sharing as you're going through that right i've been making videos on, on facebook for a while on my journey sharing my journey and 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 it touches a lot of people it inspires a lot of people and i think I'm not, I'm not the best life coach in the US or the world and I'm not, right? Maybe I'm not ready to do what I'm doing, but I'm executing and as I do that, I'm sharing my journey, right? But I never, for me it was hard to, to think about the idea of like, okay, maybe, what if you just execute for a year and a half like 18 months that's a long time right I feel like we especially Millennials and young people we have a hard time thinking very long term right it just the world is moving at such a fast pace and it's a whole different world I love how I feel like we're dreamers right Millennials and young people we're, we're, we're always dreaming and, and imagining and like we're very passionate about life because we we're at a very different time than past generations, right? Our parents and family members and grandparents, they can't understand our vision. They can't. Many can, but a lot of them can't because it's, it's a whole new world today than what it was 50 years ago or whatever, 30 or whatever. It's a whole different world. It's, it's just like if you take them from this planet and just send them off to another one, it's, it's a whole different world. So for them, when you say, oh, I just want to make videos and inspire people and, and, and build a business around that, they can't comprehend that. So obviously you're going to get some resistance, which has been really tough on my journey. Like when I get comments of like... <laughs> that maybe are not the most supportive from people around you, people you, you, you care about, um, that can be discouraging. That, 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 can, that can kill your motivation, your inspiration. But if you have a big, like really big dream 
and a lot of passion and, and enthusiasm for what you want to do, for what you want to bring to the world, for the mark that you want to live on this planet, for the legacy that you want to live after you pass on, right? I love also Gary Vee says, like, don't worry about the followers that you have. Worry about how many people go to your funeral. funeral. And I think that's, that's a nice, like, shift in perspective of, like, okay, maybe don't obsess about the number of followers. Um, I feel like now with social media, we all do that, right? Um, but maybe care more about how deeply you touch the people that you do touch, right? Maybe I think now I was obsessed about growing my YouTube channel, but maybe now I also want to have a deeper conversation with you, have a deeper relationship that maybe I start making these videos and you start asking me questions and then I make a video answering your question and, and we develop a nicer relationship, a deeper, deeper relationship, right? Um, I think that's the power of social media, media nowadays and I feel like that's what we can do. Um, and so I think an advice maybe for, maybe for older people that it might be amazing if you support millennials a little more, if you show them that that you're there for them and that you support them on whatever they want to do, but also millennials, like, be able to understand their point of view, right? Um, another thing that just came up in my mind, like, for older people, don't underestimate millennials. Just because they're younger than you doesn't mean that they have really cool perspectives, points of views, ideas, vision. Think about that. Think about that. Um, but also for millennials, like have a little more compassion, empathy, understanding for when people maybe don't get you, don't understand you, right? Um, and I think I've gone off topic, but I, I'm, I'm, I, yeah, I'm going to make more videos about this. I, I thought a while ago about making more videos about this because I feel a lot of the people that I met in my generation, like we're all kind of like lost. Like we don't know what to want to do, what we want to do in terms of career, what we want to do in terms of like where we want to live, like how we want to make our money and, 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 and develop our careers or businesses and, and just what kind of legacy we want to live in the world. So. I might make more videos about this. Let me know if you want that. Uh, let me know. Um, so yeah, I'll make a lot more videos. So if you like this and if you want to hear more, definitely subscribe, like the video, share it if you want to. Um, I hope it helps. I really hope it helps. And I forget what, what the main point that I wanted to touch on was, but uh, that's how my mind works. It goes all over the place. So I hope, really hope that helped. All right. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Have a good day. Thank you.